Well, g'day everyone and welcome to Diamond Art Waddell. How is everyone today? I hope we're having a great day. I have an unbagging for you guys. So we've got some cool products to check out from New Homie. So kindly New Homie um, has recontacted me again. So thank you, Kevin. And I have been able to select a few cool products for you to check out with me on the channel so without further ado I think we should get stuck into this bag because I know there's some really nice goodies um, awaiting to be investigated basically so somewhere or other I already snipped the bag so I knew where these were from and in the bag we have one Three, uh -huh. four, there's a little one in me, and rattle, rattle, five. So we have five products to show you. How exciting is that? That's a nice little grouping. So we've got a few in the opaque covers, uh, a cool notebook here. I'm really loving these notebooks. These are awesome. These are so much fun. And we have got some bookmarks and a few other surprises. So we might put these guys to the side while we investigate these ones first. So eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Um, but you know what? I've done a few notebooks. I might just jump straight to the bookmark because I haven't actually unboxed a bookmark before. So we're going to come down and get a little bit closer. So this is special drills. Bookmark. Okay, so the all the bits and pieces in the bag, we'll take all them out and we'll put them... Okay, we've got a kit here. Got baggies, otherwise it is got your basic starting kit. All you need to diamond paint and get started in this cool crafting hobby. We have two tassels. We'll have a close look at those. And some drills. And of course, ooh, la la. Two lovely, they are leather. Um, rather big, very pretty. Uh, bookmarks, there you go. So this is a set, you get the two together. I thought this was really cool. Uh, I really like this one here. I have done the actual diamond painting of this lady and I thought, and I gave it as a gift. So I was thinking this would be a lovely thing to put with it. You know, it'd be a nice matching pair. So this is really pretty. It's got that big sparkly drill right there in dresses. Very pretty. Let's get a bit closer, shall I? Do, do, do. Can I, can I? All right, so you have your little top notch hole here. That's where your tassel will be attached. You have your lady and all her hair is all got drilling. Nice clear field there for that. And her beautiful peacock colored dress. Again, really nice clear symbols, etc. on this one. Beauty, beauty, beauty. I might just move the other guy out of the road a bit so he doesn't try and focus on that. Having a look at the back of the material, it's really nice and clean. It's got a really nice feel. It's squishy. It has a nice texture. They're big, like... How big are they? I don't know. I should have measured that, shouldn't I? But they are big. Uh, the little tassels that you comes 
with is a beautiful soft green teal color swish that's pretty that feels so nice look at the little gem on top you got a little bead and this cool little covering bead cover and you attach that through there so hang that over the back of the book or whatever and this will mark your page if you have kitties in your house this may or may not be a best idea to attach it because I could just see the kitty cats loving that just absolutely so yeah those with the kitty cats may or may not wish to attach the tassels but they are very pretty maybe if you get a set you could turn them into earrings how cool would they be as earrings anyway that's the jeweler side of me going off beautiful I love that that's so pretty okay so colors are great drilling area looks great on that one we also have this gorgeous peacock image you've had your limelight moving over and this is very beautiful as well beautiful printed area here some more special drills and grindstones I should say and some big special drills here in the peacock feathers very pretty design nice clean leather back and the little hole to attach your tassel very pretty one thing I was going to say and they've got the little film there so once you sort of take that back can we see look at the detail isn't it beautiful wow that is very very clear and it's very very nice beautiful colors this is going to be absolutely gorgeous I'm going to be looking forward to working this very very soon I would really like to have a go at this one very very soon they are really nice and they're quite oh, you know the texture like they're only thin but they're not flimsy that's for sure nice very nice bit squish very nice 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 Look at that. so that's the pair of those you get in the pack beautiful colors as seen two tassels and of course the drills that come together so this will be interesting because all the drills are in the same packet okay I'll go with that because you probably just have crossovers of each color okay so we've got some loose bags and then we've got your rhinestone so we'll just pop the baggies to the side for a moment while we just check out what's in here okay so we've got basically to number six nothing really much on there just a K and an S sure if that means something different having KSQ and that doesn't have a K I don't know anyway I'll have a look at what we've got and we got some pretty soft soft red really some golden colors lots of those plenty of blue lots of pretty green if I remember correctly the ladies dress had a lot of green some really bright blue rhinestones as well and a beautiful purple so you'll use all of these colors on both of the kits and then 
you have number seven which are these beautiful little no, they're like little petals, aren't they, off a flower or something? Or teardrops. Little shards. They're in a pink. And I also have a few of these really pretty round facets in sort of a goldy fire orange. Trying to get them to actually show their colour up the right way would be good. Pretty. And I have some of this beautiful tealy blue. That's just so it's pretty colour. Wow. Whoa, close up. Instant zoom went off. This is lovely. Mmm. So that's number eight. Oh, that's, yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. That goes there on those. That makes so much sense. That's going to be gorgeous. Love that. Okay. Um, so that was eight, nine, and then, of course, ten. So you have three of these. You've, I see there's only two spots on the dress, so they have sent me three just in case there's one damaged. This is such a pretty drill. Big special drill. Perfect for um, that lady's dress with the peacock look going on. All right, so quite a few special drills in amongst this lot. I am going to put them all back in. Because I think that will be a lovely little project. You will have to probably do the pair together. But let's face it, it wouldn't take you too long to whip up those two little beauties, which are out of focus. There they go. So you use all the drills, different ones. Four will still be four, and one, you know, and five is five, and etc., etc. Yeah, so pretty. There we have it. Oh, and of course, the tray. So that is the kit for these guys. So yeah, how cute is that? I like the little twin pack idea of the sort of goes together that's very cute very very nice all right pop that to the side somewhere because that will be fun project and i'll bring them back to the channel and show you how they go all right so i have a mandala notebook to show or sketchbook i'm not sure what's what this one is they are different when you're on there, you go look for a notebook or sketchbook because one will have lines, one won't. Again, with these cool little zip bag things. No brand labels or anything on the front of this one. Just a clean pocket, which I think is a great way to store the little book and all its bits and pieces. Ho, ho, ho. There is stuff in that bag I'm so cool for. Rightio. So... Not only do we have the beautiful Mandela book, we have our kit and our drills in there. So there we are, that is all of the product together. Don't need that right now or that. We are going to have just a look at this beautiful cover. It's an A5 size book, 50 pages, and there is so much drilling going on here. I'm keeping this one, child. You're not scoring this book, I tell you. This one's for mum. Mama Bear's keeping this one. Wow, look at all that. Lots of beautiful colours. Big drills as well. Simple number system. Love that. 
and very very clear easy to read symbols and lots to do I tell you what this is as close as a full drill you get in a special drill partial isn't it lots going on there beautiful leather book again love it be better if it's focused and oh yes it's a sketchbook this one is a sketchbook cool that's so cool oh, the colors are beautiful beautiful greens blues oranges yellows pinks purples you name it this thing's got it this is a very cool mandela so pretty love it so simple all the numbers for the little rhymes Ooh, stick like you wouldn't believe there's some glue coverage guys some good glue coverage and then for the special big shapes you've got letters so it's nice and easy to decipher which is what on there beautiful product love that i'm really looking forward to working this one up too and those nice big blank yellowy tinge paper doesn't really bother me 50 pages really useful fun project there love that okay so we'll just pop him to the side somewhere we're like putting that side let's go that side let's have a look at these guys so the drills are special drills for that mandala really nice these are cool new homie thanks kevin hey <gasps> oh la la look at this straight off the bat so how many colors do i have in total a lot uh seven regulars eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen by the looks of it in total of different colors and drills beautiful straight off the bat we have that blue a b beautiful coating lots and lots of those pink rhinestones we have a beautiful sea green that's very pretty beautiful blues is that like a oh it's gonna say it's not peridot it's more we've got that lime very limey green beautiful golden yellow to orange whatever a very regal purple that's so pretty and I'll check this out holy moly whoa they are about 10 millimeters I would say 8 to 10s faceted beautiful golden color drills they are awesome I also have some beautiful AB mauve marquees and some gorgeous sea green teardrop facets OMG oh I like these this is a nice AB coated orange like teardrop smooth and it's just like a big claw and I love it it looks so effective on your diamond paintings it is awesome and look at this what was I just saying about this being an awesome type of drill and I have heaps of them not as big as the ones from the last painting I was showing you or product I should say because it wasn't technically painting um, but look there's heaps in there oh <gasps> there's one come to the top pretty wow love those peacocky looking ones Moses they're huge they are just huge I thought the other ones were big like this this is that golden facet but it's definitely bigger it's more like a 12 mil there's the other boys there they are so 
So you've got those. I'm trying to get all this in the one shot. It's going to be getting my hands around the right way. But you have a look at that to... Oh, if I can pick it up. No, nope, my fingers just won't let me. The sizes of a standard... There you go. Standard rhinestone. Compare to these guys. They're big drills. So these are some big, awesome, special drills in here. Love it. So cool. Oh, I need to do this. God. Oh. Mm. I want to do this one now, new homie. Seriously. You guys, this is so cool. Darn it, I've got to finish the one I'm doing. But you, I want to do you. That looks so cool, all the different drills and that in there. Okay, give me a sec. I'm going to put the back in the bag before I lose everything and get things muddled up. Because that's a cool kit. There's some really interesting drills in there. So this one here, the Mandala, is the one with the really cool drills in it. And check out down below in the description box because I'll have all these linked for you to check out. And um, yeah, just check out all the links there and codes and stuff because you can get yourself some really cool products just like this one. Alrighty, um, let's open one of these guys now. Why not? Hey, just why not? So cool. Alrighty, I was planning to do some more than um, the puppy dog one from New Homie I started with the sheep. But I may just jump into one of those. I think I need something to cut this with. What? No, maybe I can just brute force it. Yeah, why not? Ta-da, I did it. What's in here today? This is a very cool order. I mean, I did pick them out. I should know what they are, but still, it's very exciting. Cicadas. I can hear the cicadas going off. Okay. Wow. 26 colors. This bad boy has 26 colors. Nice clear table though, isn't it? Nice chart. With DMC colours in the works. Nice simple image. Well, not, um, symbols, I should say. Loving it already. <gasps> oh yes, this is so cool. Oh my goodness, that looks pretty darn good. That looks pretty darn good. It's a 30 by 30. Wow, 26 colours. Sorry, I'm getting so excited. The table's shaking from me getting all excited. Oh, so this is this rainbow tiger with little butterflies and everything I saw on there. I thought, yeah, I really like that. 30 by 30, how's it going to come up out? You know what? I reckon it's going to come up all right. Plenty of block colour blocking going on in this background and lots going on here, but hey, you know what, looking through the viewfinder, she looks alright. And in real life. So it's got like that rainbow paint, you know, drooping type artsy going on. That's very groovy. And a big tiger. <sighs> hey, that's kind of cool. Lots of colours. Jeebus. All right, so let's have a look at its gorgeous features. Oh, don't forget the kit. They all come with a kit. Don't, don't worry, you'll have plenty of kits. As I said, lots of colors, very well printed and clear, easy to read. A symbol guide down in your chart and DMC, DMC numbers to boot. Love that. Trying to make it focus on the letters. Hmm. 
I think we just zoom zoom. Zoom zoom and down. Okay. So we'll just scoot around, have a bit of a look. As you can see, pretty darn clear. Some of your darker colours, you may need find yourself needing a light pad. Not too bad, but could be like at least they're using a light white colour on here. Otherwise, it's really, really great, honestly. This lighter colours, the print on that, no problem. Some of the black where the four is um, might be a little bit hard to read, but it's pretty distinct with the colour behind it, so I don't think you'll get too muddled. It's not like blending in three different browns or something, you know what I mean? Like it's pretty, its neighbours aren't too bad. So I don't think you'll really have too much to worry about. I love the fact that it's still got the drilled eyes and not just left plain or something. Uh, 30 by 30 and a thumbnail. So you can just check out the whole image, see how it comes across. That's pretty groovy, isn't it? You can sort of see what I mean by the little paint drippy things down the side, which is these black lines. I'm just jumping around too fast with the camera to take it all in. My iPad's like, stop. Yeah. Very nice. Very cool. Okay, let's check out its drills. Chuck you up there. So we have round drills. I have round drills, 26 colours, that's a lot of colours. I don't even know where to start. Wow, there's a lot of that background colour. Well, oh, that's 18, that's 26, I can't find the right end of things. Ah, oh, bear with me people. Here we go. This is number one of that particular diamond painting and you can see we have DMC numbers and that on our actual packaging as well. And I will just quickly just go through all the colours because there is 26 I believe and there's lots of different colours. The drills are looking pretty good. Pretty good indeed. Some really pretty pur purples and pinky mauves and stuff as I untangle the rest of the ribbon. Some bright greens and some yellows and some bluey purples. More blues, browns and greys. And that's, oh, I love that. That's really pretty. That pepperminty green, isn't it? So many colours to have in this DP. That awesome orangey red. And, um, I don't know what that is. Brownie red colour. I can't tell you. Not today. More blues. That's kind of a pretty sort of colour though. Hmm. Uh, sort of a mustardy yellow. And welcome to the background colour. That is all your background colour. I also have this one. It's a nice hot pink with a few hanger-ons. Got some friends from the other baggies. And 19. For whatever reason, 20 and 19 are separate. It's got a sticker on it. We'll go with that, shall we? Sure, why not? So there you go. That's awesome. Like that. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, where did that come from exactly? All right. 
bear with me. I'm just going to pack this up and then we'll go to the next so, one. So we have another nice big painting. We can have a look at this one or the other one. Hmm. I'll go with this one. This one looks like a saying. Open me. I want to be viewed by everybody. I want to see everyone. They need to see me. Awesome. Okay. Wow. Just look at all the colors poking through. You already know it's going to be awesomely colorful and cool. And wowzers. <gasps> Ooh, in the fish sheet. Um, some baggies and whatnot. In my little boat boat. So what have I got? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, yes. This is a 30 by 40. Here's the thumbnail. If I can get that up there. So pretty. Lots of colours. Don't hit that too hard. So your thumbnail size is 30 by 40. Relax, dude. Let's make this canvas relax. It's going to give it a wee relax. relax my canvas and listen to the cicadas having another chirp. Voila. Now we need to go up a little wee bit for this one, don't we? A wee bit higher, she says, please. Coolios. That's pretty much all of it. How cool is that? So this is um, some cactuses. There's are rainbow cactuses. That sort of comes across pretty good in this size. I think once it drills up, it'll be look better. 24 colors. Voila. Lots and lots of colors in this one. So you have so you, those big flat type uh, cactuses. And then they have a little flower on top. They look really cool, eh? I don't know if I've seen blue ones before, but <laughs> they are really cool. Those big sort of flat style cactuses and the other sorts there. I might even just put an image for this one so you can see uh, the difference. So we might just pop that there. Okay, so there we are. So yeah, anyway, that's a 30 by 40 24 color from the distance I'm standing back from it and I can see a very nice clear field of print and the chart looks good I've got top left and bottom right of the chart some of the features there and you do get your thumbnail so that's pretty cool pretty cool for school crunch goes a stand all right so beautiful colors I really love all the bright colors they're very pretty and they work nicely together what's this say okay okay cool cool we can do that tips and so forth 30 by 40 there is your thumbnail for what it's worth And yeah, we'll have a look once it settles down. And you can see all your drilling field on the side here. It's beautifully printed, nice and clear. As your chart, DMC numbers. Really nice, simple chart. Like that a lot. And the drilling area is very clear in its print. Even the darker colours, they look quite good, don't they? They can be a little bit tricky sometimes. Browns are usually not great. But these ones are pretty good. They don't look bad at all. This looks quite, you know, it's one of those air travel areas you'd have with dark colours and browns mixed together, but 
That's worked really well. Really cool looking colours. I really hope this does come up um, as nice as the image because it's a really cool image. All right, so that's our canvas for that one. So I'll just pop him aside and we'll have a look through the drills in this package. Package. Oh, here we go. This one actually has an inventory sheet. I like this already. We'll go a little bit higher now. Okay, cool. That's very helpful because that thumbnail is not really helping me. Um, on your struggle bus, struggle bus. Here I go. Alrighty, well, we obviously um, get from all sorts of companies because this one's very different again in the drills. Different type of packaging. And inventory sheet. I like this part. This is cool and it's been picked off and checked for us. So this is very handy to have in the diamond painting because oh. um, you can see all your colors. Someone's gone along and just checked off make sure your package is in there. Although K and 9 I don't think have been ticked off yet. We're getting around to that so hopefully they're all here. We'll have a look in a minute. Um, yeah, and how many bags of each and a nice print size. I mean we've got heaps of room over here guys, we could have gone bigger, just saying. And <laughs> all that, but there we go, that's a better bit of print of the image. Let's see the cool spiky cactuses. It's a really cool image, I like it. Just hopefully the paint the diamond paints up well. So there's a lot of paper there, so we could have gone definitely for a bigger image, I thought. But, you know, this is handy, very, very handy to have. And, oh boy, this loose stuff. Okay, so, <laughs> this is those little baggies that, instead of the nice ribbon, I've got all the little baggies here for this one. Which I will check them all off properly in a moment. But the drills will be okay, I hope. They usually are. But the drills are no real difference in these sort of ones, usually. Just you've got this gold writing on the back to find which one is which. So your DMC code number. Is the one you need to follow off the baggies. And count each one. It's just got its number of blue or whatever. They're all being cut into sections of its individual colour rather than separate bags. Some people just have all little individual bags for some reason. Creamy colours, quite a bit of that one. So all round reels. Ooh. All round reels. Sorry, my focus was going a bit wonky then, for some particular reason. That's that beautiful blue in it. It's so pretty, that sort of purpley yes, tinge to that blue. So nice. Pretty. Very, very pretty. Lots of pretty, pretty colours. Look, it's just blue, pink, whatever. Greens, there's so much in here. These are really lovely colours. A mm, couple of small ones there. I suppose they're different, are they? 741 and 742. Peachy colours. 
purples, blues. There you go. Just so many to choose from. Alrighty, lots and lots of drills there. I don't think you'll run out in a hurry. My goodness, that's that's a lot. Anyway, I'm gonna pop all these back in the container. Okay, so it's come to this. The last one for the video today. I really enjoyed looking through them. They've been a lot of fun, a lot of very different products. So if you like anything here, check it out on your homie. Oh, ew. This is sticky. Oops. Oh, there goes the bag. That's okay. So, yeah, if there's any products here you like, check them out. New Homey. So, it'll be linked down in the description box for you guys. Alright, so I have a kit with some plastic tweezers. Other than that, it's usual. And voila. I have. Oh, I wondered about that when I saw the tweezers. Ooh, you know what tweezers mean, don't you? Mm hmm. Everyone's nodding their heads going, yeah, I know what tweezers mean when I see them in a kit. Okay, let's get this a little bit closer. So this is uh, one of the bookmarks. I really like this image. It's so cute with a big tigger. Look at him. And I have a brown tassel with a little thing going on. What's that? Is that like a little flower? It's flat on that side, but it's got, yeah. Very cute, isn't it? Little design on there. Brown tassel. Oh, look at you. How do you come out? Oh, this way? Do you come out this way? Can you go out that way? Nope. Oh. I can take you out the bottom, can't I? Yeah, there we go. Oh, I can't see it in the plastic. It's coming out. Oh, that's so cute. It's like a little lotus flower. I think, I don't know. Anyone know what that is for sure? That's so pretty though. Oh, and this is the tassel. It just, look at it. It's beautiful. It just feels nice. This darn paint is worth it for the tassel. Look, it's so cool. I just love the tassel. That's really pretty. I love that. That's going to look so cool. This is humongous. This is a big bookmark. This looks awesome. Look. <laughs> and if it's stained, folks look even better. Is it a different size to the other ones? Or is it just my imagination? Slightly. Ever so slightly more. Just that little bit there on the bottom. So, so cool. Okay, so I've got a beautiful tiger. It is full drill. You do drill the whole thing. Just taking that back. It's, oh yeah, there's so much glue. I don't know if you can see that in reflection, but look at that. It's a beautiful, good pour of glue on there. No problem at all. Um, I'm just trying to figure out if I go up or down with the view. Should I go this way? There we go. That's better, isn't it? And that is your drilling field. Lots of browns, so they look nice and clear, which is a really good thing because you wouldn't be able to use light pads with these leather items but 
as you can see is really nice all the way through it's such a lovely little thing oh he'll be cool to work up to all right so cute love its tassel very nice that's very pretty okay so drills now as I was saying you know what tweezers mean when you see them in the kit yeah and that usually means we have square drills now I don't usually do a lot of square drills but I guess I will be to get this beautiful tiger that I wanted <laughs> that's just how things go and I think it'd be good to um, do a post review on something with square drills as well because a lot of you guys enjoy working with squares as well so why not review some things with squares as well as you guys may enjoy doing squares over rounds it's everyone's preference it's a nice looking ones there i don't think they're too oh, a few little edges we'll see how they go We will see. Uh, yep. A few lips there are here and there. What's the yellow ones like? Pretty yellow. Pretty yellow. And the tanny colours. decent sort of look at them mm. trying to so you got a lot of browns and tones and things like that I'm more just trying to have a bit of a look at the actual drills See how they're going for their edges and shapes. They seem to have a nice facet and nice shine. Interesting colour. And some white. some beautiful big gold oh they're the ones that go on the edge yeah they're the jays a beautiful big gold trim around it oh how regal mr tiger very very you they are cool way out so this will be a very interesting little piece to put together i really do like the appearance of the image and this tassel is just to oh it's gone <laughs> Let's try that again without the blur down. So there are your drills, your beautiful tiger leather bookmark and its gorgeous tassel. It's just so pretty. Just love it all. I just think it's gorgeous. And this J is what this gold goes all the way around and borders the entire thing. So how cool is that? That's awesome. That's just awesome. I'm loving it. Even for squares, I'm loving it. There you go. Uh, fingers crossed, it works well with the squares and I don't have any troubles. But um, again, I think this will be definitely one of the post review pieces I'll bring back to the channel sooner than later, hopefully, and let you know how it all goes. 
But there you go, there's some awesome products there from New Homey. Um, really enjoyed unboxing these today, so thank you very much New Homey for supplying me these awesome products. Um, so from myself to show, to review and show my viewers. So thank you to New Homey. Um, I'm sure you guys have enjoyed looking at all these awesome products too. And yeah, um, I think there's been some interesting, very different things in the diamond painting um, world, I suppose. Check out today some uh, bookmarks and journals or whatever, sketchbooks and stuff. It's just a nice little change and they make a great little present or gift once they're done up or as is. And I just think they're a really nice little breakaway project when you've got a nice big beautiful image you want to work on. These are great little breakaway projects so really fun and enjoyable. And you can whip them up in a day or whatever or however long you like really. How cool is that? So have get yourself some of these and have a diamond painting party. Do, 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 get the girls on the wine and do some drilling. How cool would that be fun? That'd be fun. Alright, uh, pretty much that comes to the end of a very fun unboxing video. Some awesome things to check out. I am looking forward to working on these and showing you guys the completed projects and let you know if there's any issues I have with them. But yeah, I think that's it. So sorry this has been a bit longer than I usually do but I hope you enjoyed it. And thank you very much everyone for joining me today on this channel for this re unboxing of these great products from your homie. And yeah, thank you very much everyone for stopping by. Uh, for those who are new to the channel, please consider subscribing and so you can get some more updates on these guys and how they're going. And there's lots of new unboxings and so forth coming your way. So hit the bell if you'd like to be notified about things happening on this channel. And to all subscribers, thank you very much for coming back. Without you guys, um, yeah, you really do make it all worthwhile. So thank you very much. Until next time, I'll say be your life beautiful with diamond art. This is Dell signing out. Have a wonderful day, guys. I'm off to do some diamond painting now. See you later.